Let me explain to you. It's very, very different having a social media account under the name of the Russian Irish, for which I have total control over, meaning that I can block certain people, I can delete videos, I can control how I sound, how I look, and having my real name in a national newspaper, alongside a picture of me with a comment that was made to me about Irish men not approaching me because I'm Russian. My name is directly associated with my daughter's name. My daughter goes to school. My daughter is a teenager. And if you know anything about children, they can be quite cruel. And with the narrative that was put out there about me, anything can happen, from bullying to physical attacks. There is already cases of Russian children being bullied. So bear in mind, I never gave my consent. And I said no many times. No means fucking no. My account is public, but under the nickname of the Russian Irish. My videos are not downloadable. You cannot stitch them. You cannot duet them. Those are my preferences in my settings. Plus with a disclaimer in my bio to say that you cannot use my content without my permission. Because I want my videos and I want my views and I want the information that I talk about to stay on my account only, my social media account. And then when people go off and use my content for their own sick agenda, twisting information about me that I never ever provided, making me look like country's enemy number one, all the while putting my real name out there, is a danger to my child. And also, I'm quite thick-skinned and I'm strong mentally. But what if I wasn't? What if that was the last straw? Now, it won't happen. You can keep fucking wishing. But what if? And my daughter was left without a mother. Or what's worse, I was seriously hurt or killed because he joined the bullies in making me out to be some kind of public enemy number one and a Russian spy. Do you even realise how dangerous that is? Just in case you weren't aware, yes, physical paper, it's news one day, gone the next. But this article is online and many, many people shared it. If you Google my name now, that article is the first one that comes up. So in terms of my employability, which directly affects my daughter's future, I could now perhaps face problems getting a job. Now, I won't keep fucking dreaming. I've always been very honest about who I am and what I stand for. I have fantastic qualifications and really good work experience behind me. So I'm not worried about that. But what if all these fucking fascists and newspapers and journalists and news channels, they're all just fucking vultures. See, the truth is boring. The truth is boring. But creating a sensationalist story is not. People will follow it. People will listen. People are fucking sheep. Before you tell me I'm a hypocrite, think about that. 